Hello everyone and welcome to 2019. Uh, it's great to be back. I've, I've got a few videos lined up ready to go, but I, I wanted to uh, I wanted to talk about a new series of videos that I, I wanted to do, which uh, I'm going to start with doing this one. So basically I want to do a set of question and answer videos. So in, for example, this video, I'm going to uh, let you guys ask as many questions as you want in the comments I'll pick a few and in the next video I'll answer as many of those videos as I can uh, so with this video I'm going to answer the top three questions that I get asked all the time so number one I'm in high school and I want to get into cybersecurity what should I do the first thing you should do is stay in school and uh, finish your your high school or, or whatever you guys call it wherever you are after you've done that or while you're doing that I would highly recommend going to cybrary.com I'll put a link in the the thing down the bottom there uh, cybrary is a really good resource there's heaps of stuff on there I'm not sponsored by them or anything I wish I was I'd probably make some money and um, yeah, it's, there's a lot of really useful information. There's a lot of free courses. There's, there's heaps of shit you can do on there. So definitely go to cybrary.com. The second most asked question I get asked is, what do I actually do? Uh, recently, I've been uh, running a, a startup called airdesker.com. Um, I'm also one of the directors of a company called Datasec. And I also uh, contract myself out to mostly governments or local governments, state governments, etc. around uh, Australia. And um, my main job is mostly policy writing, which um, is loosely cybersecurity related. It's a lot of stuff like uh, the Cybersecurity Essential 8, going through those and uh, finding the holes in their network or, or their systems and saying, okay, this is what you need to fix to get through the, uh, the requirements of the government. And um, yeah, if you want me to do it, I can do it. Or if you want to go and find someone else to do it, that's fine. But I, I basically just go through and write all those documents out for them. And um, yeah, that's, that's essentially what I do every single day. Question number three that I get asked too many times maybe is how much do I get paid uh, doing these cybersecurity audits for the government it depends how much they really want to pay but it's usually around the 900 Australian dollars uh, a day mark um, I'm there usually from around 8 30 until 3 30 or 4 p.m. in the afternoon and um, I get like a half hour to an hour lunch break. I don't know. You, you, the longer lunch break you take, the longer you're not being paid, basically. They don't pay for your lunch breaks, usually. Uh, so, yeah, that's that's pretty much what I've been up to. My first three answers to the questions. I'm probably going to pick uh, five to ten questions uh, for the next video, and I hope to release that in the, uh, in the next few days. So, please comment the shit out of this and I'll uh, I'll answer as many of those questions as I can and continue to going forward. Thanks guys, catch you later.